all right so my crave door is not closing all right so you try to close it and it's not closing for nothing right all right so today I'll be showing you how to remove this this hook right the door latch now the door latch sometimes it is breaking side right we have one here right this one right now the reason why this in um this not closing because it have a spring that's holes right as you can see the spring come right here the high tension spring and it's hook on the body of the door right so sometimes in this case right how this how this so slack this piece here break out this piece of plastic here the holy spring it break out that is why it had no tension on the hook right now to fix this now all you have to do you have to get a replacement one right you have to change it you have to make sure you have one like this same size right put on the spring and hook it inside all right so i will show you how to open it to replace it now all right so you need a flat screw to push it and you take out the arm um, the cover all right you got the seal around the door so you need a flat screw and you just pull it out Now you have to be careful how you take out this because you don't want to, um, it has some clips right on the end. You don't want to break the clips. Alright, so you have to be careful when you when take out this part. Alright, see it's free. Alright, so the next step now is to kind of, yes, sometimes it does hold on that screw, right? This outer, this outer door frame and this inner frame does hold on that screw. Right, so you watch to see if you have any screws, and I ain't seen any screws. So sometimes it be difficult, right, to, to replace this. Sometimes you have to take out the, the front piece. Just to take out this part, you have to get the front cover, the front door. Right? So and this is spring long there. Right, so the spring good, not the wrong spring. Is this part that break out? That hole is the spring. Right, that part break out. So to get this out now, you just have to put a flat screwdriver here and raise it up. And then you just take that right here. Right, and then you pull out this part and that is it. Right, so this one now. Right, so you can see right so you can see this piece break out the holy spring this break out right on the end here right so that going right on the end here that holy spring right
and this is a replacement one as you can see it have the the place to rest the spring on and this one will have this is the, um, the damaged one all right so I'll install it Right, so that is the idea. So I will put it back on. Now you want to be careful when you put it on this because sometimes you can break. You can break it, right? You can crack it. I can break. So you have to be very careful not to rough it up. Alright, and now we're gonna catch back the um, the spring on the body, on the door itself. Right, I'll catch it and get back to you, right? Alright, so there's the spring right here. The spring. So you can see the spring hook up. And you can see it hook up on the um, on the hook and on the body. Right, right inside here. Yeah. It hook up on the frame. Right, so. Right, so remove the flathead screwdriver. This, this seal all right so I'll test out and show you working All right, so it's working good. All right, so thanks for watching all my videos. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, leave a comment. Until next time, Mr. Fixer 360 saying good luck with all your repairs.